Day one of three today, heading out to JFK to start my trip. It actually started with a deadhead to JFK yesterday, but since I live in the greatest city in the world, I was able to just be at home and uh, hang out. So in the Uber now on the way to JFK, typical New York City rush hour morning traffic, but uh, we got about 30 minutes left in our drive and then I'll be at the jet pre-flight that bad boy and taking the 767 from JFK to Memphis, upturn in there and then Memphis out to SFO San Francisco for a nice 36 hour layover. So uh, another airline pilot vlog, hope you come along with me for the ride. Let's go. All right, we're out here on the ramp at JFK, about 40 minutes prior to go. Finishing the walk around and then one leg over to Memphis, just over two hours and we should be on our way. So hopefully for smooth skies and a clear ride. Just landed in Memphis, Tennessee, uh, windy bumpy coming in but uh got it done my leg to monitor captain did a great job crosswind landing on 18 center flew the blues arrival and got in uh right on time so everything worked out now i'm getting into the sleep room got about three hours until my next flight uh out to san francisco so i'm gonna change out of the uniform grab some lunch and uh, do some work on my laptop before getting back into the flight uniform and out to San Francisco for a nice layover. So um, gonna get some work done and then back to work. So not too much downtime here, but looking forward to getting out to SFO. <laughs> landed runway 28 uh, right in San Francisco it was my leg great overall flight super smooth no storms I uh, got a visual approach coming in at 28 right decided to click off the auto throttles and autopilot and I thought it was a pretty good landing but as always captain's discretion captain 1 through 10 the people are gonna want to know how did uh, Pilot Pete do on 28 right and co coming to SFO Pilot Pete, yeah, 10 out of 10 no notes great Wow great Great flare, great power control, nice job. There you go, power control, flare, 10 out of 10. You heard it here, folks. You heard it here first, folks. Getting better each and every day. Now it's time for a nice 36 hour layover. Let's go. So, I get asked a lot about keeping in shape on the road, eating healthy, working out, and there really is no secret. My mantra, if you've been following me for a little bit now, is non-negotiable, but I just flew from New York to Memphis, Memphis to San Francisco, and the first thing I did, I put my running shoes on and I went for a run, got my blood pumping, got my heart rate going, and on my way to Chipotle, which I know isn't the most nutrient-rich meal there is, but, but you do it right, brown rice, tons of chicken, just a little bit of sour cream and some salsa and a little bit of cheese. It's really not that bad. So, and I, hey, I earned it. I worked out at lunch time, shoulders today, and then ran about three miles. So got to refuel the body. But no, in all seriousness, you just got to have that mindset of, oh, I'm tired. I worked all day. Get the body moving. 30 minutes at least. Bare minimum, and no matter what, you get that heart pumping, you're gonna feel better, you're gonna look better, you're gonna perform better. So remember, non-negotiable, let's go. It's a beautiful day out in San Francisco. Got my morning stretch in, it's almost noon. About to meet up with my buddy, go for a nice little run, get that body moving, let's go, let's go. And, uh, go for a run, and then I uh, get some lunch, go for an exercise. So moving the body, 
keeping positive, enjoying San Francisco, baby. Let's go. All right. That was my buddy, Andy Gass. Say what's up, Andy. What up? Golden Gate behind us, going on a five mile. Nice and easy pace. Getting our, getting our work in. Like I said, non-negotiable. Every single day, move that body. Get moving, get working. I'll see you at the finish line. Let's go. Just finished the run, five miles in the books with my buddy Andy Gass. Now it's time to get some fuel in the body. Sweet green is always a easy, a little expensive, but healthier option while you're on the road. So stopped into sweet green, double chicken, about to hammer that down. And uh, yeah. Enjoy the rest of San Francisco. So we just finished oh, yeah. eating at Okani Sushi. We're gonna go tallest to shortest review. Andrew, you're first, one through 10. Smile, you've had a good dinner, buddy. There it is. <laughs> Smile, I'm thinking of my review. I'll go, I'll stick with an eight, eight and a half. Eight and a half out of 10, okay, okay. You know, this is Miss gonna Anna? sound crazy, but like crazy? I'm kind of thinking like, Nine, ten out of ten. That was absolutely wow. delicious. The fish Folks. was so fresh. Wow. So we Thank love you. to hear it. I'm going to go ten out of ten overall. Sushi was fantastic. EP, our waitress, was amazing. Unfortunately, we couldn't do sake bombs because your boys got to fly in the morning. But SFO, it was fun. And we got an early morning flight back to Memphis. Let's go. All right, just got out to the plane. Pre-flight is all done. We're ready to go in San Francisco. Great layover. Just under four hours heading over to Memphis this morning. It'll be my leg to monitor, captain's leg to fly. He's gonna show me what the captain skill set is all about on our way to uh, on our way to Memphis. But mostly clear skies. Got a little bit of weather uh, over Little Rock in Memphis right now. It's hugging the East Coast there, uh, heading up to the Northeast, but. Should be a pretty smooth ride up at 35,000 feet on our way eastbound this morning. Um, heading out the Trunken to RNAV departure and, uh, and then on our way out to Memphis. So smooth flying, smooth flight here on out we're hoping for. See ya. Touchdown in Memphis, pilot monitoring, great flight. Just under four hours, landing at three six left. Flying down the Hobrick three RNAV arrival. And uh, yeah, taxi to our gate a couple minutes later. So all done with the trip. That's a wrap. Now it is time to catch a jump seat back to uh, New York since I'm a commuter. So I uh, hope you enjoyed the vlog. I had a fun time making it as always if you have any questions feel free to shoot me a dm on instagram i do answer all of them and uh, any comments below the video would be appreciated and let me know what you guys think so i uh, hope you enjoyed the ride come along for the next one hopefully in about uh, a week or two all right pilot pete out see ya